You earned a bonus gift for playing the demo version to the end. Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Pikmin 4. It's time to continue where we left off, and see what happens next. What areas we have left to explore? Just as an extra side note, in some interviews that have been going on, I believe, the creators of the game, or and, and original creators of the game, were saying that this game will have more collectibles than the previous titles combined. And also, when the original game was being created, the Pikmin were supposed to be cute in design, but also you're giving off a slight feeling of eeriness, which is quite interesting to think about as we continue on and as we think about the series as a whole, I guess. But anyway, let's go. Continuing on from day seven. I still have to get the rest of the stuff that I missed. But yeah. And also I believe there is a way that you can use Ochi to get the the blue onion if it falls into the water as well, possibly. At least from what I can tell from looking up what other people are doing. Hey, we got five bomb rocks, we completed the demo version. Is that really all we get? I mean, that's pretty good because we can use that against things. But wow, it's just that's just it I get, I guess. Is there anything else we need to get? Something tells me no. <laughs> and that, that is correct. Hmm. Anyway, I think with everything we've done, I think it's time to explore a new area. Picking up some signals that may be coming from uh, other castaways in the most recently discovered area. There could be a stranded rescue officer out there. We're counting on you to rescue them. Preferably very soon. Let's go. I'm kind of tempted to finish off Sun Speckled Terrace. But I think we'll go to the new area straight away. A lot of the treasures here that we haven't collected yet are in caves that we've been to already. And a few, just like one or two on the surface that I haven't collected yet from stuff we've already done, basically. But anyway, blossom Blossoming Arcadia. Zero percent progress in going to a new area. It's kind of crazy. Also, we need 4,000 Sparklium to upgrade something. Increase our ship's capabilities. So There's definitely a lot of stuff we can do, just starting off. This place is beautiful. So beautiful. But anyway. Let's take a look at our surroundings and see what we can do. I should also probably check the Pikmin numbers as well. To see how that's going. How do I... Status report. Got a decent number of Pikmin to start off. I still haven't got the blue Pikmin on this file, so we're gonna have to go back for those. Find out what's happening. A lot of uh, extra information that I want to just probably ignore. I don't know if... No, we do have to go through all of it. That's a shame. There's a lot of stuff. Hang on, I didn't finish up all the things. It's fine. Headlamp. It's good, so when we go to somewhere dark, we can see in that. Rescue journal. Just want to make sure I... I just don't like having the new icons and things. Which is a shame when there's a lot of notifications for something on my phone. I'm pretty sure we've had a look at most of this already. It's all shown up as we go, so... But anyway... Let's probably start with... Auto? Whoa. Suggested is not Red Pikmin. At all. That's strange. It's probably good, though. 
Also, what is this thing and is it good or bad? It's a snagger of some kind, but also... Get it. Make it pay for what it did to me in Pikmin 1. I mean, not specifically these ones. These are just small ones. We've not seen them this size before. But these are like serpent birds, which is kind of strange. But it is what it is. Also, hello. Another crane. Let me get that. See what else we can do. Can't go that way. Gonna have to really think about which direction we go. I love how open this feels, but also... Because I've not played this before, it's so... So new and you so much to explore. Let's take a look at that, maybe. Also, this thing. You have to land on it to try and take it out. I think it's only one Pikmin to carry it back as well, but I'm gonna leave that, probably. We could have Ochi actually carry it back, and that might be alright. Because Ochi will come back to us. There is so much here. In every direction. I don't know even which way I should go. Have to build this bridge, let's do that. Oh, hello. You need to be more careful about the leaves on the ground. Because those are enemies, so... Also, how do I have a ice picking with me? I don't know. No, my ice pikmin! Ah! I need to be more careful with these enemies. These snaggerets, because they're not... They're not simple snaggerets. They are still a pretty, pretty strong enemy type, so... And it's a shame to lose my ice pikmin when I have so few. Get back here. There we go, got it. We can't really replace uh, Ice Pikmin easily. But it's fine. Just trying to figure out what to do next. Let's pluck that. I think the bridge is almost complete. It might be a good idea to actually go over there. There's a base over there by the looks of it. But there is also the rest of the enemies over this way I want to take out as well. Also, does this yellow... Does this yellow... What's it called? Butterfly, does that maybe give me more Pikmin if I get it to yellow? I don't know. So I'm going to have to learn, I guess. Nice. Just want to take that out before it causes problems. Um, I guess Ochi can carry that back. That's probably something I want to take advantage of more. Is just having Ochi do things for me while I'm doing other things. Haven't found a dungeon yet, which is interesting. There's also a thing up there. I, have to th I think I have to go around to reach that. Also, whoa, that, that, that thing from Pikmin 3 is in here. That's a little bit concerning, but that's okay. Bridge is complete, so let's go check that out. There's also a thing in the water over there. I forgot actually I could just go through the water with my Ice Pikmin. And explore some more areas. There's a lot of bad things already. Just in general. Oh, so this place really reminds me of... The second area in Pikmin 3, and I like that. That was definitely the best area from that game. Also, hello. How am I going to get you? I think I need more Pikmin for that, probably. But that'll be good to get. Also, why do I feel like there's enemies... Here... Maybe some of the flower enemies from Pikmin 2 or something. Also, there's definitely a treasure in this thing, isn't there? That's interesting. I wasn't expecting that, but there is. A golf ball. Let's get that. Try not to get killed by that thing. That's what I thought. Also, whoa. That looks... Interesting. It's like a frog thing. I might leave that for the moment, if I can. Oh, she has arrived. I should probably... I might try on the other side of the... this way for now, possibly. Try my best over this way. I should probably pull out some reds instead of ice pigments so I'm not having to worry about losing them as much, maybe? I don't know. It's so hard to judge when I know absolutely nothing about what I'm doing. Just gonna do that, because I can. Oh, you can get that. Also, this thing. This thing is... Not good, basically. It can make electricity on its body. 
which means we're probably going to get one yellows for it, but it can also eat a, a Pikmin. We're going to have to run into a lot more difficult enemies from now on, I think. Which is just a shame. It's gone from 0 to 100 very quickly. Also, there's another yellow onion. Huh? I mean, that's probably good, but also, huh? That's strange. There's a dungeon over that way. Might be good to get. It also might be good to do that. So can I command Ochi gather Pikmin? Because that's probably going to be helpful. Also, what was the music just now? I heard, like, I think it changed because there are enemies. Which is interesting. Move base over here. I don't know if that's much more efficient than what I was already doing. I think since there's a thing up here, I might as well. Also, it's a concern to me how many things they're giving us for reproducing Pikmin, because that means that at some point it's going to get really bad, probably. Do I have enough Pikmin for that? Apparently not. I only have 18. Strange. Also, what happened to Ochi? Oh, he's coming. He's almost here. I still don't think I'd have... Oh, it doesn't matter, does it? As long as I... Do it like that, that's fine. Doesn't need to be the right Pikmin type. Let's get rid of this electric gate. We can discover this cave, which we might want to go into. Possibly immediately. But I also want to get these treasures back first, if I can. There's also the enemy across here as well. We have to take out first. Grab all that. I don't know if this will be enough Pikmin for this, but that might be okay. Come back. Oh, does that just make more Pikmin? That's interesting. That made a lot. Is something wrong? It sucked up the onion, but nothing nothing's happening. Looking at the life signs inside the onion, there are 20 more Pikmin than before. As long as we already have an onion of the same color, the new one just gets turned into nutrients. Interesting. This, like, really makes it more open. In a kind of way. I like that. It's just very different to what I would have expected. Here we go. Hello, Ochi. Very convenient timing. Get that. How much does this need? Five. That works for me. It's another doll. Another half of a doll, anyway. Need to keep an eye on that treasure meter, because that's probably going to do a lot for us. I might as well get this back as well. If I can. Already halfway through the day. New cave discovered. New treasure collected. There's so much. There's just so much. Also, there's treasure in here. The meter is saying that there's treasure inside. That's interesting. At least I'm pretty sure that's what it's saying. Unless there's a thing below me somehow. How are we doing for stuff? Is it there? Did it work already? It might have. I was trying to wait for it to do something, but it might already be done. So why is that shaking? That must be carried, car being carried by an enemy. Also, look how huge this place is. It's massive. Also, the shaking items is concerning me because those might be done, like... No, they might be bosses, possibly. Also, there's so much. Ah, uh, but anyway, let's try this cave. Secluded courtyard. In the natural world, there are many examples of, of strategic mimicry where one lulls their prey into a perceived safety. But I never thought I would witness it firsthand. I know the... I now know danger can lurk in even the jiggliest of places. Interesting. Let's take the recommended Pikmin. I guess, hopefully we won't lose more Ice Pikmin than where we have. Just need to get good. But this is so cool. Just so cool. If I start having trouble though, I might go back to the first area to collect the stuff that I've already collected. 
and regroup my Pikmin numbers. Just want to show the cutscene again of going in and out of places because it's really cool. Okay, let's take a look around, I guess. Are these traps? I'm assuming these can be bad. I'm assuming these can be bad, very bad. Thank you. I don't know what would happen if it managed to survive longer. It's a little bit concerning. Is that real? I think so. It's strange. I'm expecting them all to be bad now. <laughs> it's fine. Get him. It's helpful that we can actually do that with Ochi. We can only put on so many Pikmin, but we can also put Ochi on the task as well. That's good for us. So don't stand around. Also, blue Pikmin? Nice. Let me just... Get this. How do I dismiss my Pikmin? I can't just press a button to, to dismiss my Pikmin. Forgot about that. Also, traps. These things. Okay. Also, blue Pikmin. Right there. So if I can tell my yellows to go do their own thing, we can get them. I mean, that works. It wasn't exactly what I was trying to do. I haven't seen Pikmin like these before, except we have. Aww. Now we can carry things in water. Which, if we get enough of them, we can probably also... Um... What am I trying to say? We can also get the blue onion from the first area. Although I'm pretty sure there's probably going to be another blue onion somewhere else as well. If I had to guess. Also, I think I have to go around the long way. Oh, I forgot I can also just ride Ochi and jump. <laughs> you know, the simple thing. Although I guess it's not going to matter much with me carrying my Pikmin since I have to drop them all anyway. Kind of, except I can also freeze this, but I probably want the blue Pikmin first. Let's get off. I disband. Disband. Although I guess it doesn't matter, but I want to do it anyway. Let's pluck these. Nice. Okay, Ice Pikmin. Freeze. Now we can go across with all our Pikmin. There's the next part down. Let's get... We good? Not quite? Maybe now? I think we're good. <laughs> I was just not expecting a trap that big. That's a little bit concerning. Do we still have all our Pikmin? I think so. It's hard to tell, although we have an even number of total. A nice strong 50, so... Need to keep an eye on that. This place looks really interesting. There's a lot of stuff in the background I haven't noticed before. But again, really cool. 2,500 sparklium. Nice. Is there everything on this floor? Yes. Cool. Let's go deeper. I'm really enjoying this. 25%. So there's four levels. Don't know how many treasures and onions and rescues there are, but there are four levels. It's very interesting. I like this. I like the way they've done this. Okay, what's in here? An egg. Must be a castaway nearby. Okay. Uh, get that. I mean, it's sure it's fine, but also... It concerns me. And concern- it concerns me deeply. Okay. I really don't want to lose my blues at all. 
Oh, uh, Wally Hop? Or Wally Hop? Yeah, Wally Hop. Okay. Well, I guess I need to be very careful with this. Let's disband. I guess I want to just keep my blues, so I'm going to spend them. I'm going to take Ice Pikmin for this, and hopefully not lose any of them. It's a bit of a weird choice, but I'm having going to have to live with it. Also, what happens if I freeze the water while it's inside? It freezes it. And I can just take it out, probably. Which is awfully convenient for us, so... Got to use our terrain trust advantage. Nicely done. There's a bell. There's also those things again. And also this geyser thing of water. Oh, they got waterified. I didn't think that was going to happen because I can be fine. The Pikmin got wet and needs some help. Get rid of the water fast with by whistling it. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to happen because they can go through water and freeze and stuff. But I guess it's not enough. Gonna need the rest of our Pikmin stuff, so... Let's get that. And let's go get the rest of our Pikmin, which I think might be... A good idea to actually... Gather Pikmin. Like that. That's a sound. Okay, so we have to use our blue Pikmin to get rid of this water thing. Water spout. And we're gonna have to use our yellows to get rid of that. I don't want to know what it's called. It's a spider thing, so I never want the cold for some reason. Just a long legs. I don't know. <laughs> That's the best I can do for figuring out its name. Okay. Have to break the thing off of it before we can attack it properly. And if we get too close with it, it can shoot electricity because it's yellow. That's how we need to keep track of what does what. But the different different colors of these spiders will also do different things as well. But they like to use objects as cover as well, so let's get that. Might be a good idea to nope. Commando Chi again to gather Pikmin. That's just a, a good thing to have overall. I think. Just trying to lift those. That's fine. Probably should have just let them do it. Wow, they really are doing a good job of this on their own. Just need to be careful. Kiwi fruit. Get that half. Oh, oh hello! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I don't approve of this. Oh, you have the... One of the... You. You have one of you. You know what I mean? Might be good to lock onto it a bit. Definitely don't want a other Pikmin to get zapped. Do I want to knock it off? I really hope I'm not accidentally throwing any of these. I might need to take a second for this. Disband. Disband. How am I gonna... Nope, that's not what I wanted. Ah, disband. No, hang on. Let me try this again. Nope. Nope. It's been a little bit, apparently. Disband. We'll keep the yellows. It really has been a little bit, apparently. They can't reach it because they're not on it. They have to actually land on it. There we go. Let's get all this stuff back then. Figure out what else is here as well. That, mean, that took me way too long to do that. Oh well, here's the next floor down. There's also another Wally Wog. 
Wally hop. Wally hop. I don't think it's ever been called a Wally walk, but I call it. I've called it a Wally. I don't know. <laughs> Basically. Command. Get a Pikmin. It's just such a helpful command to have. Also, we can't freeze the Wally. The Wally hop this time. Wait, what? What are the. They have like five names in my head for some reason. Also, can it hear the whistle? Oh boy. Uh, oh. Okay, that's a choice. Oh, Ochi, you've made an interesting decision. I'm gonna call them when they're in air, I think, or not, before it jumps, maybe, I don't know. Just gonna take my time on this. It's always good to take your time on these enemies, because they're annoying. Probably pick them back if you need to. Oop, he jumped. Come on, thank you. Let's get rid of that as well. Oh hey, more yellows. Let's get those. Okay. I can't decide what I want to do here. Let me just focus on getting this item back. Also, can I? Yeah, it's probably a better idea than what I was doing before. Please. Come on, there we go. I think that's all I can reach over there, so... Why did you do that? What? <laughs> that was strange. Oh well, they're going for it. That's probably more than enough, so... Yeah, way more. Get all those back, and that's probably everything on this floor. Also, we can't charge while we're on on the thing, which is probably an important distinction to make. I think that's everything for this floor. No, not quite. There is something else over here. Oh, right, the... Oh! Oh, hello! There's also the... Stowaway. Stray castaway. I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Flushed away was my next guess. Good thing there's nothing for them to carry. Except the other one's got this castaway as a shield. Okay, there we go. Let's get this castaway back. Find out who they are. So I think that's everything on this floor now. Also, I've just left these ice pikmin in the ground. In this ice for a while. No, no problems with it, but they've just been sitting there for a while, frozen in the ice. Might as well take them. I don't know. Okay, who do we have here? Francis. Fra 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 Franc Francus. I mean, I'm pretty correct about that. Research Task Force Recruit, Home Planet Uji. For years, this scholar has been working to achieve his lifelong dream, re reaching mutual understanding with plant life. The Research Task Force. I had no idea there were researchers stranded here too. Well, there are. So how about that? That's everything on this floor. Very nice. Let's go deeper. <laughs> 